This is a viewer requested video of the Petunia Picklebottom Wanderlust wallet. It took me a really long time to decide on a wallet to replace my old one that I liked and this is the one I went with so let's see how it works for me. Hey guys, it's Emily from Our Nightlife. A couple of you asked after I posted my picture of my new wallet on Instagram. Um, it's the Wanderlust wallet from Petunia Picklebottom. If I could show what it looked like on the inside and what it looked like packed so I thought I would just show my old wallet and then what was in it and then what I put into my new wallet. This is um, my old wallet. I've had it for six plus years. It's coming apart here. It's coming apart on a lot of the seams and even on the inside the lining is completely ripped here. Um, so it's had better days and I think it's time to replace it. Um, it's from MNG or Mango. I tried to look up what the style was, but I couldn't even find it online. So um, the Petunia Picklebottom retails for $54. And um, this is the Champs Elisis Stop, if I pronounce that wrong, my bad, um, pattern. And I got it on Amazon, but I had a $10 credit there too. So it only cost me $44. So I'm pretty excited. All right, let me show you what it looks like. So this is my old setup. It just had a snap, and then it flipped open, and then it had like a try thing. Baby K, so old. Also, second baby syndrome. I don't even have any of D in here. Um, I'm engagement pictures. All right, so, and then just like a pocket underneath here that I used for voter's registration card and stuff like that. And then the lining was where my money and stuff went, and other cards that I kept. And then, let's see if I can undo this. Had a really big coin pocket, which is good because I always carry a lot of change, or I accumulate a lot of change anyway. But one of the things I didn't like was that um, unless you zipped it all the way down, you'd lose change. And I was always losing change because of that. Okay, so this is the Petunia Picklebottom Wanderlust Wallet and Champs Elisa Stop. Um, I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it, but I'm going with it. This is an embossed wallet, and it's really um, soft, and it's a little bit padded. Um, it's got this beautiful stitching on it. It's like a steel gray with a kind of purplish hue to it. And then it has this glazed um, lining, I guess. And then on the inside, it also has everything is this glazed fabric, which I know from other Petunia Pickle Bottom moms that this is really easily washed and wiped off if you spill on it, which is great with kids. So on the inside you have this really big change wallet, um, change area, um, which is good because I accumulate a lot of change. Some four pockets that are a little bit shallow, more shallow than the other pockets that are over on this side. You have your standard size regular wallet pockets and then um, a billfold area. And then finally you have a spot for pictures and a spot for your driver's license, and another billfold area. So that is what the wallet looks like with nothing in it. So let's get some stuff okay, in it. So I got it packed. It was really easy. I had plenty of room to spare and add more stuff in it, but let me show you what I've got going on so far. All right, so in the back I have my driver's license, and then I have the bill, um, my money in here. There's a little bit extra room in this one, so that's why I decided to put my money back here. Um, I didn't get to put any of my pictures in um, because these are all K. I don't have any of Baby D. Look how newborn K. Um, because they're a little bit smaller than the standard wallet picture. So I'm going to trim some down and then find a good one of the two boys to put in there. Um, and then the change coin purse. I did not transfer all my coins. I gave some pennies and nickels to my four-year-old to put in his piggy bank because he likes to do that and because I accumulate it too quickly. Um, okay, so these aren't super shallow like I thought. They do hold stuff. I've got my library card and my Costco membership card in here. I'm not sure if those are going to be permanent spaces or not or if I'll move them with my other um, cards to like a coin purse. But And then this area I have my grocery cards, travel cards, credit cards, and um, insurance cards. And then back here for right now, I have my other um, membership cards, the City of Las Vegas Parks and Rec, um, Children's Discovery Museum card, um, 
Springs Preserve and a casino card. In Las Vegas, some of the casinos have um, daycares, and a lot of our casinos have movies. So there's a play, uh, not a daycare, a play area, and you get a discount if you have a casino card. So that's nice. So this is what it looks like packed. Like I said, I'll add some pictures. Um, you can also, and I did try it, put your phone with a cover inside of here and zip it shut. So I can put everything right in my diaper bag zip it up, and then grab it as I need to if I was just running to the store without any kids. So that's my new wallet. I'm pretty excited. It took me over a year to decide which one I liked, and I'm glad with the one I picked up. Hope you enjoyed this, and let me know if you have any questions or comments, and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Have a good day.